morning guys. I am so excited to bring this particular video to you because I literally live in active wear. I work for myself at home and it is the comfiest thing to sit around in all day while I'm working. So I thought that it was about time to update my wardrobe and while doing that I thought that I would do a haul for you because it can be really hard to know what the fabric is going to be like and how it's going to sit just by looking at it on the website. I usually completely stalk the brands on Instagram and everyone who has tried on their clothes when I'm about to buy something because yeah, I guess active wear can definitely be hit and miss depending on the thickness of the material and all of that as you will see in this video because there were some things that weren't great um, but then obviously there were also some amazing pieces that I love so I'm excited to share that all with you in this video I'm even I've got one of the pieces on ah, at the moment so um, yeah, I've already started wearing them, but I yeah, I'm excited. I've got pieces from Gymshark, Do You Even, and Etched Apparel. So I'm going to be reviewing those three in particular today. Um, I do have active wear from other brands, but they're just the ones that I purchased from recently. So I will show you some of the new stuff. And yeah, if you have any questions, make sure to pop them down in the comments below. If you're excited to have a look at some of the pieces from these brands, then make sure to also hit the like button and subscribe for more health tips, which is usually what my videos are on. And yeah, let's get started. So I've got all of my pieces behind me here and I will hold them up and kind of show you the material but I've also tried all of them on just last week so I will also pop up like a little box here that shows you what they looked like on. So as you can see a lot of the pieces that I chose were blue or green um, so I actually wanted to choose one piece that was pink just for something different so that I wasn't wearing the same color every single day. So the pink one that I went for is the pink camo set from Gymshark. Um, to be honest, I've seen Georgie Stevenson wear this a lot and she always looks absolutely banging in it. Um, so yeah, I thought that I would try it out. It's actually a really nice pink color. I feel like it's not too girly um, and I wasn't sure how I would feel about the camo because I don't really wear a lot of camo print, but it's really, really subtle. So yeah, it's actually really flattering and I don't think that it's too much at all. So as you can see on the try on, um, it's really quite flattering around um, the top. It is, it does have more cleavage than most sports bras do, but it actually is super supportive, so it holds everything in. So even though it does have a little bit um, more cleavage, nothing's gonna fall out. Um, and even if you lean forward and you're doing exercises, um, it doesn't kind of like fall up out of the top. Everything is held in nice in place. So. Yeah, I definitely love the support of this one here. Um, and then we also have the leggings and Gymshark um, are always really good quality. They're nice and thick, but not too thick. Um, and their band here just holds you in without being restrictive because it does have quite a stretch to it. But like I said, it is thick, so it does hold everything in. Um, and it does have the little bum scrunch there at the back. The only cons that I had about this piece um, were to do with the pants. So sometimes with some of the Gymshark pieces, you can see the like crutch seam from the front. Um, so it's, yeah, I don't know. It's not that bad when you um, try it on, but you'll probably see what I mean on the try-ons. Um, and also the bum scrunch. It's nice to have there, I guess it's better than not having it there at all, um, but there I have seen better, more natural looking scrunches on the bums of some other pants as I will show you. So yeah, overall I think that the colour is super flattering, they are an amazing material as always, Gymshark definitely knows what they're doing, um, and this one even though it shows a little bit more there, which you might like, um, it is super supportive and nothing's going to fall out. So. And it's a really nice pink color, it's not too pink. So yeah, I definitely loved that one. The next piece that I tried on were the shorts that I'm currently wearing. So I really, really love them as you can tell because I'm currently wearing them today. Um, and also this um, long sleeve shirt here that actually matches the color of the shorts so it is a nice cute little set so like I said before Gymshark usually has really good material and I really do love the material of this it is 
super flattering as well um, and it is thick without being too thick. Uh, the only thing is that I probably would recommend wearing a black sports bra um, underneath it just because when I had the pink one on it was just because I had previously tried on the last set and it did kind of show through and I feel like it kind of clashed a little bit um, which isn't a big deal but then I tried it on the next day with a um, black sports bra that was just plain um, and it looked a lot better. So yeah, I also really love the thick band down the bottom. So. It's not so thick that it cuts into you and causes like muffin tuff or whatever, um, but it is just thick enough that it means that the shirt will stay down. So if you raise your hands or you're doing any overhead exercises, um, then it won't ride up at all. So I pretty much got a small in everything, uh, but in these tops, I got a medium just because I don't love things being really tight up under my arms um, and yeah I felt that the medium was perfect in this if you don't want it to be too tight. And then the shorts that I'm wearing right now they are super flattering I feel um, the waistband like I said is thick but not too thick so it just holds everything in without actually cutting off your circulation so I have been wearing them um, just doing chores around the house today I went for a walk and they did didn't ride up or anything like that. They're a perfect length, so they just kind of stay in place. And yeah, I love them. I love the color of them, of both of them. The color is just gorgeous, and whenever anyone sees them, it's what stands out straight away. So I think that one is definitely a crowd favorite. My next piece, I actually already had the tights um, from probably about a year ago, so these tights. Um, here are just a Gymshark as well and they have the similar thick band up the top um, and then I just wanted a matching top because I always kind of buy random pieces that never match together so I thought that I would try and get more sets this time um, so I just got this set here um, and it is a bit annoying that this is blue and this is pink so they don't match um, entirely but it's not the biggest deal because I feel like the greys are actually very um, similar they match perfectly so same goes here with the back it works better with a just a plain um, black sports bra at the back but exactly what I said about the blue one so this is the same kind of top just in grey and I really love the thick um, band down below I think what makes it so good is that it's not tight it's just thick which is why it stays down and stays in place so yeah I really really love that one I love the gray color and you could wear that with black tights or really whatever color tights you want so I think that that is an amazing staple and just like the blue I got a medium so that it doesn't ride up under my arms and yeah if anything I would say that if you don't want a lot of midriff showing then those tops those long sleeves probably aren't the best because even though they don't ride up they do sit um, quite a fair distance from the top of the tights um, so yeah I guess it just depends on what you feel comfortable with but if you're looking for coverage but just like crop meets tights then they're not really going to be the crop for that. Oh, I also forgot to say that those long sleeve tops they have the thumb holes as you would have seen and the thumb holes are actually very comfortable. Some tops like the one coming up um, it's actually not comfortable like it kind of pulls on the shirt a little bit which is annoying but these ones actually had super comfortable thumb holes so you could actually wear it like that without it cutting off your circulation so to quickly cover the delivery and shipping and returns process because I know that that's also a very important thing to consider when you are buying online so as of the moment I don't know if they changed their policies but as of today Gymshark is currently doing free standard shipping over $120 um, and their returns are I think it's because of COVID their returns are currently 90 days so this is all for Australia it might be different if you are in a different country um, but I know that they definitely do deliver to different countries so just go on the website and check it out um, but yeah they're currently doing uh, 90 day and full refunds as well so you don't just have to get store credit they will actually refund you completely and I know because I've done it before the refund process is so easy and streamlined and it's not a stress at all it's actually all done through the website and you pick which it's kind of I don't know if you've done a refund through the iconic but it's very similar like it's very easy 
and yeah it's free returns as well so they will actually pay for the return postage so yeah it's very risk-free I feel shopping at Gymshark just spend over $120 and then you get the whole process delivery returns and shipping and everything free so now we're going to move on to the do you even pieces and the first one that I'm going to show you is the teal set so this set is called the hyperflex seamless crop and leggings um, and the crop actually did stick out a little bit you can't really tell when you're just holding it it did come bent as well um, so you could see that when you were wearing it it is an absolutely gorgeous color so I do love that about it um, and I don't usually go for greens but this was really flattering but um, yeah it was just I don't know if you can see it on the video but the padding kind of stuck out a little bit and because it is a thinner material I probably wouldn't want to wear this without padding um, but that's just me I know a lot of people do like to wear their tops without padding um, as far as the actual comfort of the sports bra I did really like it and I felt very supported and I did feel like everything would stay in place um, so yeah that was a win so now on to the tights. Like I said, I really love the color and the material does feel super nice. Although when I tried it on, it wasn't really sitting right. It kind of looked like the material in the crutch area was a lot thinner. And even though it doesn't feel thin now, it just sat a bit weird. So the actual, the pant, I don't know how to explain it. Like the pants were, they don't seem overly restrictive and they do stretch quite a bit but they were creating a muffin top where there isn't usually a muffin top. So I thought that that was a little bit weird and I wasn't sure why that was, but also, um, yeah, I don't know, the material in the crutch was just super thin and bunching. So it did um, kind of create a camel toe easily. And I don't know what it was, but my it was actually making my pelvic bones stick out. So I don't usually have that problem even when I'm naked. Like, I don't know, my pelvic bone isn't really um, what's the word? Obvious? I don't know. But um, when I put these on, it really looked like it was like my leg and then my pelvic bone came out. So I don't, I don't know. It was weird, but I think that I will return these because I don't think that the crutch area was super flattering. Um, but the rest of them were really nice. The color was really nice and I did like this one um, under there. So. I don't know, that's not to say that it's always weird for everyone because I have seen a lot of girls wearing it on Instagram and it looks gorgeous. Um, so maybe my body is just not cut out for these leggings. So the next set is this electric looking blue color that I am absolutely obsessed with. Um, it's actually called Sky Blue. And so I'll start off with the crop. So the crop just looks like this and it is really supportive it's really really comfortable um, I got a small and it doesn't really dig in anywhere and yeah I really really love the crop so I'm very obsessed with that crop and its color I'm gonna be wearing that a lot um, and then we have the leggings and these have a similar thicker waistband which is good to keep everything in um, but similar to the last tights that I was just talking about it did kind of create a muffin top and some pudginess where there wasn't previously um, so I don't know why that was kind of sitting like that on me but it wasn't anything like terrible um, so yeah it might just be I don't know the way that they were sitting on my body so I wouldn't discount them um, but the material was a little bit um, thinner in the crutch as well with these um, so it wasn't as obvious but whenever you did kind of stand with your legs like together the fabric would bunch because it was a bit thinner in the crutch um, and gave a camel toe look even if it wasn't actually a camel toe it kind of just bunched there and gave that kind of a look um, so that's a little bit disappointing I probably would prefer if they were a little bit thicker um, around the crutch because then when you get to this um, material here that is I don't know like ribbed um, it goes thicker again so it's kind of like thick 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 thin um, so yeah I don't know what or how I feel about those um, but the color is absolutely gorgeous. So yeah, then we also have the matching Matching blue long sleeve. So it just looks like this here And so these ones are called the impact seamless oh, I just hit myself in the head with the tag and this one's called the air seamless. So they're not um, identical, but 
they work really really well together and I really love this top it is it doesn't have such a thick band like um, the Gymshark ones do so it probably would be more likely to ride up than the Gymshark ones but in saying that I have worn it quite a bit and it is quite flattering I've never had a problem with it riding up um, and I think as well it is longer than the Gymshark ones so if you don't want um, anything showing if you want the crop to meet the tights like I was saying before then this is probably your better bet because it is longer so it will come down to meet those tights um, and yeah overall it's just super super flattering um, the material is nice and thin and stretchy so yeah I actually got a small in this one I probably could have done a medium but um, I don't really know whether the medium would ride up a little bit more. Um, when I was reading the reviews, it said to get a size down because um, it's not like this here isn't as thick, so it's not like held down as well. Um, but yeah, I've never really had any problems. So yeah, I really, really love this one. So for the delivery, shipping and refund details for Do You Even, the delivery is free. I think it's free express delivery over $50. This is all Australian again. Um, and returns are currently free up to 30 days. So you've got 30 days to return something if you don't like it. The return postage does have to be covered by the customer in this case. Um, and in order to initiate the refund, you actually have to email them first and then they email you back with a link to a returns form. Um, so yeah, it's just that one extra step, I guess, because you need to wait for them to get back to you, but they get back to you within a couple of hours. So it is pretty streamlined because I tested it for this video. Also, if you do have to cover the cost of postage, which you do with Do You Even, um, you can actually, if you've purchased your active wear through PayPal to begin with, PayPal will actually pay you back for the cost of return postage for up to nine items a year, I think, or sorry, nine orders a year. Um, so you might wanna look into that because I just purchase anything that I might need to um, refund and pay for return postage um, through PayPal and then I can just claim that back. So the next brand that I'm going to show you is Etched. And so the first piece that I'm gonna show you is the tights. Um, that cinch in at the bum. Now the color that I tried on for this haul is actually in the wash because I do wear these all the time. So I'm just going to show you my black version. Um, so they do have a really nice cinched bum. So this is what I was talking about when I was comparing it to the Gymshark pink camo set um, is that the cinch actually goes all the way down um, and it's actually more embedded into the whole fabric. It's not just kind of like a cinch on top. Um, so yeah, it looks really flattering in my opinion um, and the tights also have the, the waistband at the top isn't as thick uh, but I really like the waistband with the etched tights because it doesn't dig into you so I these are often the ones that I wear when I am working um, throughout the day and I actually the reason why they're in the wash is because I actually wore the what color is it blue steel version it's not really blue though it's kind of I don't know how to explain it, but yeah, I wore those all yesterday when I was working and I was sitting at my desk and I never once felt like I've just been like cinched in at the waist all day because that can be really uncomfortable if you've got something digging into your um, hips. Um, so yeah, this waistband is just a little bit more stretchy and forgiving and loose, um, but in saying that, it still is really comfortable when exercising. So. These probably don't stay up as well as the Gymshark ones because they don't have that super thick tight um, waistband at the top, uh, but I personally love them and I think that that is, a, I don't really mind about that trade off that they do have to be pulled up a little bit more uh, because yeah, like I said, they don't kind of cut off my circulation when I'm sitting in them all day. So if you do really love to work from home in active wear, then the etched tights are probably going to be your go-to. And I've also got this blue pair as well, which also have the scrunch bum. So I don't know if you can see that a little bit better. Um, and so these ones are called the etched force scrunch leggings and these ones are just called the etched scrunch leggings too. Um, I don't really know the difference between one and two, but okay. So they just have the um, brand on the back um, and this is very similar. These ones are probably a little bit more loose than these ones. I don't know why they're both smalls, um, but 
it's worth it because this color is absolutely gorgeous um, but they do show this one this color does show sweat so it's not really too bad in my other darker colors um, but this color does show sweat and I wore them to Pilates the other day and it kind of looked like I'd wet my pants so yeah probably not a Pilates or anything where <sighs> I don't know like I don't usually have a problem when I'm exercising in these if I'm just doing like weight training um, but anything where you like sweat a lot particularly in the crutch where you're doing like lots of floor work like mat pilates um, probably not a good oh, maybe it's just because it was hot pilates so it was in like a heated room um, yeah let's go with that because I don't really have an issue with these when I go on like my walks or if I exercise outside or in the gym it's just when I go and do like hot pilates so yeah I'm not going to be wearing those to hot Pilates again, um, but I do still very much love them. And then we've got these ones here, which are the shorts, which are the etched range bike shorts. Um, and we've got the logo on the back. The etched logos do um, tend to peel off a little bit easier, um, but yeah, I guess that it doesn't really matter what the logo is doing um, because these shorts are really good um, quality and I really, really love the fabric. Um, yeah, so I guess you, you get what you pay for. Um, Etched is a lot cheaper than the other two brands, um, but I think that they're super, super comfy. So yeah, I'm really stoked with the quality um, of those shorts and I actually have two of these and I think that they go just the perfect length. So they do have shorts that cut off a bit smaller, um, but I really like them just to not kind of ride up too high. So these are the perfect length that they don't really start riding up. Um, and they still do have that high waistband to hold everything in, but they're not so tight that they kind of sit you in. So these are really comfy for lounging around as well. The legs also are not super tight and they are quite stretchy, so they don't really like squeeze you in like sausage casing. Um, they are really quite flattering. So delivery, shipping and returns with Etched. Um, the delivery is free on all orders, which is actually quite insane, um, and I do really love that about them. So it's free on all orders, um, and you can get a full refund with returns if they're done within 14 days. If you return something between 15 and 30 days, then you can still get a store credit or exchange. Um, also, you are responsible for the cost of return shipping. But yeah, like I said, if you pay through PayPal, then PayPal can usually just refund you for that. Um, but if you do do that, have a look at the terms and conditions on the PayPal website because you do have to send a photo of your postage receipt um, within a certain number of days for them to actually pay you back. So just make sure that you've read through all of that and you know how it works before making your purchase and relying on it. Um, so yeah. So I hope that you've enjoyed this active wear haul and that you appreciated my honesty. So this whole video is unsponsored, but even everything that I do that is sponsored is completely honest. I only work with brands that I love, but I thought that it would help to know that this video is completely unsponsored. So there's no reason why these wouldn't be my honest opinions. And I have been pretty honest about the things that I liked and the things that I didn't. So yeah, hopefully this helps and that if you were looking to invest in some of these brands and some of these people, Pieces that you feel more comfortable doing so now um, but usually on this channel I teach you the science behind health so that you can better understand your body and become your healthiest you both physically and mentally so if you are interested in active wear and perhaps on your own health journey then I would love to have you on this channel more often so make sure that you do hit those like and subscribe buttons below and also come and check out our community over on Instagram where I share more health tips all throughout the week. Also make sure to pop down in the comments what your favorite piece from this video was and if you have any other active wear brands that you would like me to check out. But that is all from me for today. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video next week.